Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to the Renatus Jam. My name is Jay Stark, and joining me is... Mr. Matt Snyder. Mr. Matt Snyder. We are excited to be with you today. This is going to be a short podcast. Yes. It's going to be short. Yeah. No pun intent, no jokes? Short jokes? Uh... You know, I tease my daughter all the time because she's like five three or something like that. Yeah. And I I tell her just you know that she's like queen of the little people, and she doesn't think that's very funny. Why? That, she's if short. you're gonna be that, so if you're gonna be short, you might as well be queen of them. I keep telling her she's not short; she's fun size. She doesn't think that's funny either. Well, if she doesn't think it funny, you just tell her stop being short with me. Oh snap! Yes, he did. <laughs> oh, welcome everybody to the podcast. I'm really glad that you're here. We have a couple of quick updates that we're going to run through about some of the exciting things that are coming your way before the end of the year. So, Mr. Snyder, what's new and exciting? Well, do we have our Aaron? Do we have our graphic? Let's pull it. We're going to talk Ooh, about the. Uh, this is about yeah, to get graphic. This is this is about to get graphic. I I should let everyone know. Graphic content ahead. Yeah. <laughs> I see what you did see there. See what I did there? Yes. Look at that graphic. We have some graphic content right over here Ooh, that we will look, look at. Look how pretty that graphic is. And we're going to talk about uh, the Mega Tour. So this weekend is DC. Washington. Washington, DC. That's right. All right. Actually, is it held in Washington, DC? I think or it's, it's just actually Virginia or right outside of the city like that, in yeah. Virginia, I believe. So why are we calling it DC? Because D.C. is the major metropolitan area. Yeah, but Virginia is so, in Virginia. So. <laughs> it's in a whole other state. <laughs> or a state. D.C. is not even a state. They wish okay. they were. All right. So <laughs> here's the deal. We've been hearing a lot of things about you know people being sick and all of that. Uh -huh. Here's the good news. Mr. Snyder is healthy. Yes. And will be coming to... To the Washington D.C. Mega Reunion Tour, uh -huh. Mr. He Huggins has followed all of the. Uh, yeah. I can't remember if it's the CDC or the state guidelines, state guidelines, protocols, protocols as far all of as that. quarantine, and then yep. now he can be back in public. And he so, is good to go. Yeah, so he'll be there. He will be there Huggins. with bells on. Mr. Huggins will be there. Yep. Also, having followed all guidelines and appropriate measures, and so on and so forth, and yeah, he and, quarantined in the desert. Yeah, it 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 bears noting <laughs> he left society. <laughs> it bears noting that, uh, to the best of my knowledge, there was not a co a positive COVID test at all. In fact, I know that no, Bob tested for COVID and, and he, did he came back negative. He, did was, come back negative. he was he yeah. was under the weather and yeah. is now feeling much better. Yeah. So, much appreciation to everyone who's kept him in their thoughts, their prayers, all of that. He is doing much much better now. And we'll be live at the Washington, D.C. Mega Reunion Tour. Yeah, buddy. Starting tomorrow. tomorrow. That's tomorrow. Tomorrow. Thursday. Yes. Tomorrow. Right yes. on. Yes. And I know, I know Umer and Yes have not only a phenomenal event planned, but are going to absolutely pack the house. Like, it's going to be just a crazy, crazy awesome event. Yeah. I'm excited for it. Yep. Very excited. Especially so, those guys, they're gonna they're gonna throw a great one. Oh yeah. You know? Oh yeah. They always do. Um and then after that is Fort Lauderdale. So Oh yes. Gonna catch some sunshine. That's right. Down in the it's not called the sunny state. What is Florida State? It's like an orange. The orange state or something. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Something like that. So that sounds right. So here's the deal. In Fort Lauderdale, Florida, we not only have the locals there that are going to be at the Mega Reunion Tour, but I happen to have personal confirmation that Miss Debbie Worthington and a contingent of Renatus family members are coming, the Georgia team. Yeah, are coming. Are coming down there. from Georgia. From all over too. Actually, that, that's, there's, there's oh, yeah. more than just Georgia, but yeah. Yep. Yep. So, so that's, that's cool. Gonna yeah. be a good one. Oh, gonna it's gonna be. be that's a, that's the one. It's gonna be mega. Man, that's the one to go to right there, down there in Florida in November. That's gotta feel good. Oh yeah, it's gonna be nice and toasty. Yeah, yeah. Nice and toasty. Yeah. 
So then New, New York in January. Who, yep. plan, who planned that? New York and Phoenix who in January. And Phoenix was my, I, was I like, think, dude, if you're going to do Phoenix, put it in January. Do it in January, that's right? time to be in Phoenix. There's actually, I believe there's one more that's going on the list. You have hinted at such I have, in past podcasts. I, I got a text today that makes me think that. Uh, Is it going to happen? It's going to happen. Do we know where it's at? I still don't know where it's at. Oh, you don't? No, I haven't I told don't. you yet. Yeah, you haven't. It's. Probably is going to be in Seattle. Seattle. Yes. Go figure. Yeah. I, I'm not loud. saying that too loud, but yeah, I not, think it's yeah, going to yeah, be yeah. in so, Seattle. So unconfirmed. Yes. Amongst it's rumor mills it's kind of stuff here, but yeah. It's you know, in the, Seattle, uh, huh? okay. in the Navy, they call this scuttlebutt. The scuttlebutt. The yes. scuttlebutt. Dare I ask what, where did that? I mean, I have no idea where okay. it came from. I all just right. know that it is. Yeah. So, uh, all right, here, here we go. We got the mega reunion tour. Yes, we do. Super excited about that. Yep. We also have coming up starting, or you know what? Let me back up. Let me okay. back up. Starting November first, yeah. Bob announced on the Founders Live that we have started a promotion. Yeah. And and it's a promotion. It's a bonus, right? It it's is. not a competition. It's a bonus. So it is called the Everest Real Estate Conference. Yeah. E-R-E-C for short. Yes. Now, what are the qualifications to get the promotion? You got to upgrade or buy your, your Epix combo. So you got to complete your Epix combo. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can sell two. Uh, as an ICM, you can sell two Epix combos and qualified to go. That's right. We didn't want to leave those people out who already had their epics. Yeah. We wanted to include they them, but there there needs yeah. to be a a there need they need to do something in order to course. receive it. Of course. Yeah. Yep. Now, what is the bonus? It's in June, correct? It is in June. And it will be held one of like three places I've heard. One of three. Yeah. One of those being the corporate office. Yes, one one right here. One being Idaho yeah, up Bear at Lake. Bob's. You know, it's it's really funny. We call it a cabin. But once you cross 10,000 square feet, I don't think it's a cabin anymore. Until it has a moat, it's not a castle, Jay. <laughs> so, I've it's been got advocating everything. for a moat, though. <laughs> it's got everything, but, I mean, it I sits on. I think instead of a moat full of water, we should dig around it and put lions inside. Instead oh, of, instead there of like, you go. crocodiles and We'll water. have a den. Yeah, that a would den be, with a oh, drop. Cool. Here's the deal: this property sits on 40 pristine acres, just off of Bear Lake. Yeah, it's beautiful. And Bob has cut his own uh, razor track in there so that he can mm-hmm. run his his side by sides. He's got plenty of trails to hike and to well, to backs, just go and backs, explore. Yeah, yeah and, or it's, it's it's close to I should say is uh, like a bunch of public access to yeah. land and stuff yep. like that and so yeah just just a phenomenal yeah. area yeah it's beautiful it's beautiful. so beautiful and then yeah there's and literally thousands of square miles of public yes. land behind it so. yeah and if you haven't ever looked up bear lake just look up the caribbean of the west and you will see pictures of bear lake and you will understand why it's called that yeah it's beautiful it is that, gorgeous that uh, the mineral deposits in there. yes you gotta see the picture though you it, gotta see a picture yes. from, from 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 up above, high from real high yeah because it's beautiful i love it up there and the, you know 2 p.m in the afternoon the sun just kind of oh, yeah. in the, especially in the summertime around that time yes. it just hits the the lake just and right. the wildlife it looks caribbean it's beautiful the wildlife is just right there yeah you get elk and deer and moose and yeah, all of, sorts of little, of little critters all over the place oh yeah we've seen it all. rabbits are all over that place yeah like there's there's all sorts of stuff the moose are my favorite though that's what's yeah the most kind of majestic and entertaining and, yeah. and fun to just moose are so much bigger of, just than you right think of the yard moose are so. huge they are they're well, like six well, six and a half of, feet tall at you, the shoulder. I think a lot of times people think of moose as like deer. They're really like horses. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. That's a they're like a tall horse. Yeah, I get it. Yeah. They are. They're tall horse. They're like like a horse, but the belly is like a foot higher. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So that's yeah. that is the benefit. The con or the contest. I almost said contest. It's not, it's the promotion period. Quick so call it a contest. I, I'm sorry, I apologize. Okay. I, I apologize. He keeps calling the founders live a webinar. I can't oh, get this. Don't guy make to, me. I can't even don't even get this guy to, I don't know. I got to straighten you out. Matthew. So, yes. 
Yes. Matthew. Promotion. It's a promotion. Bonus. It's a, Thank you. Know, you. Yes, Thank you for promotion, correcting me. So. so it's a promotion. It started on November 1st and continues until December 31st. Yes. Which means that if you do not yet own the epics, meaning you have the essentials and the extreme, but not the profits or the essentials and the profit, not the extreme, whatever. If you own anything, but do not own the epics, all you need to do is complete the epics, purchase whatever you're missing to get all three EPX, and then you are qualified to go. If you purchase the epics combo, you purchase all three at once, you qualify to go. If you already own the epics and you still just really want to attend, you all you need to do is sell two epics combos. Now it has to be a combo. It can't just be the same uh, education. It has to be two epics combos. And then you are qualified to go as well. This is going to be three intensive. It's going to be like a mega intensive, right? We're going to have eight potentially nine instructors there that are going to be taking, you know, a couple of hours to just get as in depth with the audience as the audience wants. Yeah. They're going to answer any questions that you have. There's going to be breakout time where you can sit down with any instructor that you want and, and just glean as much information from them as possible. This is going to be as, as, uh, as intense an event as we possibly can create for education and it's three days long we never discussed where this might be the third location well the third location is still kind of up in the air but we were thinking midway utah yeah which 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 if, is a castle yeah if you've yeah. never been to midway yeah midway honestly reflects the swiss alps yeah and i've been in the alps before this looks like the Alps. Yeah, it's fun. I love it up there. It's yeah, beautiful. Yeah, it is gorgeous. Just past Park City. Yes. So, yeah. It's green and they, yeah, anyway. It's like what Park City should be, but Park City's <laughs> kind of overcrowded now. In in my yeah, in yeah. my local right living here estimation. Cause there you go. Then I drive up there and I'm like, man, this is crowded. So yeah, that that is the EREC, the Everest Real Estate Conference. Yeah. Qualify. Yep. Be there with us. It's going to be awesome. Mega Reunion Tour, EREC. Oh, we've got uh, starting December 1st. Yes, ICM Renewals. Yes. Yeah, that's coming up December 1. So you're going to want to look for that. Look for the uh, the pop-up that's going to come yep. up inside the inside of Helios. I almost called it, the, I guess, what are we calling you know, it? The center. back office, back office Helios. No, I almost called it the business center, but, uh, you know, yeah. Yeah. Inside so, of there. So there you go. Yeah. This is uh it, it's pretty standard. We do this every single year. The uh the ICM guide or the ICM application that gets submitted with every single order gives you the ability to market the Renatus material for yes. a year. Yep. And then it comes up for renewal every single December. Now, if this is your first year, if 2021 was your very first year marketing Renatus, if what we we don't we're trying to help people out as much as possible. So if you purchased after June 1st, you are going to, your renewal will be a discounted amount. You're not yeah. going to have to pay the 197 again. It'll and be so, less. You'll have to pay something, but it'll be less. Correct. If it's if you purchased after June 1st until... October 1st, is it? Isn't it October Yeah, October 1st. 1st. Yeah. So, you, yeah. You pay 125 and then after October 1st, it's no cost, no yeah, additional yeah. cost. You just have to renew. So if you, you do have to renew. If you purchased after October 1st, yes. for the first time as an ICM, then you're going to have to still renew, which basically just means sign and, and yep. agree to the terms again for, for 2022, but you won't have to pay anything. Yeah. So, so, so uh, do me a favor, everybody who's on the line, tell all your friends, tell all your team members, tell your PAC members, tell everybody that you talk with inside of the Renatus family and out that the renewals begin on December 1st and they... The, technically, the renewal period goes until December 31st. However, we've always had a grace period, which is the month of January, where we've allowed people to renew even during January, the first month of the year. It's always risky business. Don't wait. Yeah, that's always risky business, especially because uh, I've seen that date change, that hard and fast cutoff date yep. changes multiple times. Every yep. year it's different. Uh, generally depending upon programmers and abilities and, and, yep. and workload and, and such. So I would not uh, risk yes. my, especially like if you've got a team, you got qualification status, you any got of any, that. anything Don't risk under it. you, do not risk it because you just, yeah, it's not worth it. So yeah, just re-up, get, get it taken care of. Done. Um, if you don't renew, you do risk losing your team, losing your qualification yeah. status, all of that. We don't want to see that happen to anybody. We always take that call on February 1st and they go, 
oh, well, I tried to renew last night, but you didn't tell me that it actually cut off at 11.59 p.m. Mountain Time, and I'm in California, so I thought I had another hour. Don't wait that long. Just get it done now. Mm -hmm. Or not now, but, you know, get it done early. Yes. All right. Definitely. ICM renewals are coming up. Um, we have uh, we have another ten day challenge. Oh up. my goodness! Uh, have you guys seen the activity that has been created around the Renata Spartans? <laughs> it's been cool. It has been amazing. I love it. I love it. It's just I'm seeing it all over Facebook. So oh it's yeah, fun, fun for me. So, oh yeah, yeah. We we'll, we've not only created so many Spartans, but we actually now have two times Spartans. Yes, we do. Two X, baby. That's right. And they are man, they're on. You got an opportunity here to do 3X. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, Yeah. 3X. And if you've already completed it once and you want to become a two-time Spartan, join us. The next 10-day challenge begins November 30th. Yeah. So we kind of took a look at the calendar, considered all of the holidays that are coming up and and everything, and we wanted to try to be sensitive to that. And so we dropped the 10-day challenge on November 30th. It's going to go 10 days until December 9th, and and that's going to be our very next – 10 so day after, challenge after Thanksgiving, baby, come That's back right. from, come back from the break, ready to roll. Right. And if you're, if you're saying to yourself, Hey, you know, I've heard all about the 10 day challenge, but I don't know how to get in it. I don't know how to start it. I don't know where to begin. Yeah. Where do you find that? You go to the Facebook group, You go to the Facebook, Renata, you go to the Facebook. Yes. That's what they used to call it. We ask the Google the about the Facebook <laughs> Yes. and we interwebs all day long. <laughs> yes. Well, right. you're going to have to go to the Google to Google the Facebook. There you go. Get to the Facebook. And then what? What do I do once I'm so at Facebook? So you, you search Renatus 10 Day Challenge. Okay. And you will find it. It's a Facebook group. All you need to do is answer the questions to get into the group. I think there's two or three questions. It's not difficult. And they're just, you know, are you an ICM? Are mm-hmm. you? Anyway, so you answer those questions. You get in the group. And then as of November 30th, you will start to see the posts coming out every single day. Yeah, about about completing the 10-day challenge. And it's been amazing to see the activity, not just the activity, but but what people have accomplished and how they have altered the way that they conduct their business from day to day by going through the 10-day challenge. Yeah. I love it. I love hearing the stories, seeing the excitement, and hearing people that go, I now understand. I get it. I've been in Renatus this long, and now I understand how to effectively market my business. Yeah. And how to reach out to people and how to invite. Yeah, it's yeah, it's awesome. Yeah, and yeah. Anyway, it's awesome. We could talk about it all day long. Yeah, yeah. you know, I mean, uh, there's cool medals and stuff involved with completing the ten day. As we get closer, we'll probably highlight them here a little bit. Yeah, we will. We need to bring one out. But I also think uh, that sometimes people maybe underestimate because it's not necessary. It's not guaranteed that you get done with the ten day and you're going to actually close business. Right. Right. That's not a guarantee. But that is a much higher likelihood if if you don't go through the oh yeah you know, if you do it versus don't go through it yep and uh, we I get to see a lot of those orders that come through as a result from those ten days uh, especially after that first ten day challenge um, it was you know I was helping uh, with signatures and, yeah. and I got to see all the orders coming in. That was cool. So, yeah, they got a medal, but they also got paid. So oh, that, yeah. That's oh, even yeah. better if you ask me. And, and I like how you, you couch that just by saying, hey, your results are going to be different. You sure. know, everybody's sure. results are going to be different. We're all different yeah. individuals. We all talk a little differently. Anyway, as you – Well, as and it's you, also hard to quantify, I think, because uh, – Sometimes, sometimes that sales process takes a lot longer than just oh, yeah. like the week or two after oh, the ten day yeah. challenge, and so uh, you may have put a put a ball in motion that then pays you off three months later or yep. something. You know, you just didn't realize. And so, I've yeah. I've thought about that quite a few times where people are like, "Oh, I'm going to have ten guests at this event," mm-hmm. and it's like, "That's great. You cannot control those of those guests, no, right? No." You might say, hey, I know that, you know, roughly one third of the people that say they're going to come will come. Right. Right. So if I want to have 10 people there, then what you can say is I will have 30 commitments from people to show up. Yes. And then because that's something you can control. Yeah. Right. I'm making the phone call. I'm having the conversation. They commit. Boom. So so make sure that you focus on what you can control. And make sure that you don't focus too far out. Don't sit there and think, I'm going to, you know, I've never made a sale in Renatus and in the next month I'm going to make a million dollars. Yeah. 
yeah. just realize that like with the pack members i i got to i got to be part of the mega reunion tour here in salt lake with with richard and ryan and and richard stood there and he said what you see before you is the culmination of 25 years of experience doing this don't think that you are just as a brand new icm looking at somebody that you can become tomorrow you're looking at 25 years of experience being demonstrated or displayed today yeah and so, you know, it takes a little bit of time for people to get amped up, ramped up. And for different people, different amounts of time. Mm -hmm. Some people will take to it quicker than others, have experience that's more relevant to Man, what's going on. Everybody's on a different timetable. And I can yeah. talk about stories of people that got started. And in the first couple of months, they, they you know, cleared some very large numbers that I think yeah. even shocked us. Oh, yeah. So we were like, what? Yep. And, and, and it's and it's fun to and see. i can think of a handful of those people that have done that and, yeah but uh nonetheless yeah they're fewer it's just everybody's on a different timetable i and know people that are two years without making oh, yeah. anything and then and then and then all of a and sudden, see that's that's right? my favorite part about the 10-day challenge is you've got those people that say i've been in renatus for you know two years three yeah. years yep and I have now actually now got getting, guests coming now to events. I've got things in the pipeline. Yeah. And it's just like, it's That's fun. Yeah. It's so that, fun. That, that to me truly, it gets me excited because, um, I don't like to see people fail. I right. don't, I don't want to see somebody come in with this expectation and then it be unmet. That's not right. fun for anybody. And, and so it's been particular fun, particularly fun for me to see people like that. Yeah. Because I've had a few of those comments myself where right. they're like, man, I've, you know, I've, they've been a part of Renata since 2016, 2017, 2018. Right. And they're, and they're now just finally doing all these things. Right. And, and it's working and it's so exciting to see it work. It, it just, that fills my cup. It, it's oh fun. yeah. So yeah, yeah. When it, when it clicks and people start to, yeah, take start that, to start to get traction. Oh, it's so, awesome. Yeah. It's awesome. Cool. Renatus, Renatus is awesome. Just wanted to give yeah, one kind of rocks. It kind of rock. I, I wish somebody so. would say that somebody, sometime. Yeah, you know that'd be really you know, that Renatus actually rocks. Yeah. All right. So uh, just one more quick reminder, and this is just putting it out there. You know, um, on the Founders Live every single week, Bob talks about certain tools that are available to the Renatus family, the the Renatus community, and I want to make sure that you guys are aware that we have a social media presence, not just here on the main Renatus page, but on several other pages where we put out different information and different updates to allow people to to know hey if i want to find out about icm updates where would they go well so we've got several facebook groups right, right. first of all uh the the renata's front just the front face there's page. there's that one but if they want to find out specifically about icm stuff they go to i would go to the um um i'm forgetting the name of the group uh, starts with Renatus. No, I know it's uh, the ends with rocks. Is that it? That's, yes. Oh, I was. I thought it was the Renatus. Uh, what am I thinking of? Found his life. That's what I'm thinking of. Oh what? my that, gosh, that totally. It's because you called name, the, man. you called the webinar earlier. I That's why. I, I, you yeah, were it's totally just payback. It's how Jay's <laughs> getting me back. I it totally slipped my mind. Yes, I the Renatus rocks Facebook group. I should have let ICM you updates, but I guess the, the Renatus founders live is also it is as well yeah it's however also, the the founders live page is really designed to host the founders live broadcast the, the founders webinar founders live broadcast all right here's so, a challenge ta challenge for everybody next it. next monday night comment Ren renatus founders no. Webinar. no 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 no, no. <laughs> let us not do that Jay's face will turn all red <laughs> uh, <laughs> all yeah. over. Let's not do that. All right. So here's the deal. As an ICM, the Renatus Rocks group on Facebook. It's the right place to go. Yes. If you're yes. an education holder, go to the Essential Study Group page. Uh, if you want to be a Spartan, go to the Renatus 10-Day Challenge page. Yep. Um, I think that was think all the ones all that the I had written groups. down. But We've got a handful of them, we but do. that's all the groups. We do. Yeah. There are several local groups as well all over well, the country that's the other thing too. Yeah, that you that can take part in. Each team has their own stuff and so their own yeah. group and whatever. Yep. Yep. Pretty phenomenal. But those I are tell you what, corporate. this this past week for me has been just amazing. How come? 
getting to interact with all of the ICMs who came in for the mega reunion tour here in Salt Lake, yeah. getting an opportunity to connect with not just the people that were here, but so many of the people that were taking part at a distance. I don't know. It was, it was invigorating. Yeah. Just, yeah. just to feel that energy, to feel people's excitement, to hear the stories and to hear it's, just, it's live events, ah, Jay. It's I live tell events. you, it's so fun to, I guess I shouldn't say live. I should say in person, in, in person, in person yes. events. It's in person events, man. There's just something, they, there's a magic to it that you just can't really replicate oh, anywhere yeah. else. And I They're great. Yeah. That's all there is to it. Yeah. And I think we're all starved for it because yeah. you know, we miss it and, Boy, am I looking forward to nationals. I know that's not oh, on the list of man. announcements, but man, coming up end of March, people. Oh, yeah. Mark I hope you guys calendars. are ready. March 30th through April 2nd of 2022 it's is the, the Renatus place, National the Conference. Place to be. It's this be, is the way. I can't wait. This is this will be the first time in three years, over a thousand days that we will have had mm. a live national, like in person, sorry, in person this, national conference. That kind of, that hurts my heart a little Stings bit. And at the bit, same time, it? gets me really looking forward to the annual hug fest. Yeah. Reconvening. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yep. love it. So. Love it. All right. Well, on behalf of myself and Mr. Snyder, I want to give a shout out to Mr. Aaron Peterson for being our producer today. I want to thank everybody for being on the line with us and hanging out and laughing with us or at us. Either one is acceptable. I appreciate you being here every single week. <sighs> what a great week, man. What a great week. I agree. Renatus rocks. rocks.